Hey guys, Inder this side from 24 by 7 everything. Hope you all are doing great. We are again back with another video and this time it's on Asus Zenfone Max Pro M1 related to the latest firmware version 016. Specifically this video is only for the custom ROM users. So let's start with this. So for this I have already created a dedicated article on my, uh, on my official blog. The URL for the same will be provided to you in the description below so that you can go over afterward. So let's proceed with that. So firstly, I have mentioned the build number and the change logs and so on. But the most important thing is that how you can download the actual firmware for your uh, custom ROM. Uh, so basically this particular firmware is for the users who are on version 0.59 and they want to update to the version 0.16. So you just tap it here and afterward it will download it and afterward you just have to move it to your SD card. So there are a few prerequisites. Firstly, backup your data again just for the safer side. Again, charge your phone battery at least 50% and more, but I always recommend to have 80% or more for just for the safer side. Finally, the installation of firmware version 060 using TRPW, TWRP recovery. So firstly, install or flash the firmware version 060. Afterward, wipe or cache it as we can afterward reboot the phone. Finally, the firmware 060 would be installed on your phone. So let's start with the demo or I would say the actual part. For that, I have already uh, put my phone in the recovery mode. So let's start with the installation process. So as per my blog, I have already told you that you have to download that firmware and afterward you have to keep in your SD card or uh, either in your USB OTG. So I've already kept in my micro SD card. So this is the firmware file that is X00T then firmware 060. You just have to tap it here and afterwards swipe to confirm flash. So within next three to five seconds, it will uh, do the magic behind and afterward the installation of the uh, particular firmware will be successfully done. So even you can view that script succeeded with result updating partition detail and so on. So afterward, there are two options. Either you can wipe cache or Dalvik or reboot, but I will always recommend to do this part. Just do it. And afterward, just reboot your phone. So this was all from my side that how to up, uh, download and install the latest firmware 060 for the custom rooms user. And hope you like this video. If you really like this video, kindly share this with your friends and family. And apart from this, please subscribe to our channel because this will surely motivate us and boost us to create more videos like this in the coming future. Finally, it's the time to sign off now. Bye for now. Thanks.